a warning that some of the video and or language in this video will not be suitable for all audiences. Thank you for watching and enjoy the show. The Canadian team goes to Zagreb 2018. So, in this video, not only did I do like painting, preparing for the event, but you're going to be seeing the inside and out of my experience at the ETC 2018 as a member of the Canadian team in the Warhammer 40,000 tournament. All the way from getting to the hotel and checking in and meeting all the cool players to the scope of the venue, how big this tournament is, and a debrief on what I really enjoyed about the location, a dive in to the psyche and the happenings of competitive 40k. So, I'm here in the Zagreb and we've checked in to the hotel and this, my trusty army companion and myself, got here safely. 720 battle phone bag, great fit in the overhead compartment on a plane. First time traveling with an army and I was able to keep it all. 2,000 points to my Drukhari, raiders and everything in that bag. Pretty exciting stuff. So, today is Wednesday. The tournament starts on Friday, so we've got today, tomorrow, to really kind of get the lay of the land. I'm going to try and reduce jet lag by sleeping tonight at a good time and forcing myself to wake up early in the morning to make sure that I'm ready for Friday. And I'm going to go and look at the arena. It's a giant arena, and the singles event is happening right now. It's happening right now. So we're going to go and take a look. So here at the I Hotel in Zagreb. It's a nice little hotel, really cool. But the venue is just down that way. And it's not too far, it's really, really close. So I'm really excited about that. Just waiting for the other folks to get checked into their room. And then we will be heading down to see some gaming stuff happen. So there I was, ready to represent Canada at the world stage. Zagreb 40,000 ETC 2018 at the Zagreb Arena. Fantastic venue. The terrain this year was phenomenal. Very, very functional terrain. Great for tournament play with both the heavy tables and the light tables. And as we walked in for the very first time, it was awesome. Oh, there's Chris. Say hi, Chris. Hey. What up? <laughs> Captain of the Canadian team. And this is the venue. Hey, how's it going, bud? Good. It's pretty big, eh? It's giant. This is going to be filled with people. Ho oh, ho! Look at the size of that. This is massive. These roll rolls. Right now, it's the singles going on, so we're going to check it out. I have to go get our con badges just so you get a grasp of the scale and scope of this giant. So that first day was me walking around the hall, taking a look at the really cool armies that were playing in the individual European Championship. Um, and it was just a singles event. This was the first year that this event was ITC ranked and it had started earlier that day. Then again, I did go around and take a look at all the Drukhari armies that were present because there were a lot of them, but also some cool other collections as well. Okay, so it is Thursday. I'm wearing my Canada shirt, one of them. Got my stuff. Gonna be doing some practice games against Tom. So really excited. Let's see what happens. It was really great to have a few practices with the team, even before the tournament really began. And uh, our little practice game, Tom really saw what the Drukhari were able to do to his knights. Um, and this uh, allowed to help him 
uh, through the rest of the tournament. After that, we went to the downtown square and saw some of the historical sites and went for food in the center of town. Okay, I woke up. It's Friday. Ugh. You get to see me at my best and my worst during this little vlog stuff. It's about 10.30. Went to bed at like 1 a.m. Um, but I have to make sure I get up. So I'm up and about and I don't feel the jet lag. But I'm up and I'm going to go have breakfast. All right, we're doing this now. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> We're walking oh, Team Canada. The yeah, the, 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 I'll, I'll edit it. Oh, thank you. Yeah, yeah. Oh, good. No, I won't. I'm lying. Yeah. Team Canada. Woo! Round one. Scotland. Coming for you. Okay, so round one. I'm playing Blackie. Hi, hi, hi. From Scotland. The rest freedom. of the team. Freedom. Freedom. The rest of the team is playing. This is the matchups. I'm playing Harlequins, fun, and uh, Val got us these really cool headband things, so we're forced to wear them, but that's okay. We're having some fun. I'll be back after round one. We'll see how it goes. It's a lot of fun. The pattern of pairings are really cool. Blackie seems like a half-decent person. I've seen his ass already. <laughs> <laughs> yellow card! Two yellow cards, brown card! Anyway, have a good one. So my first game was against Blackie from Scotland and his Harlequins. Fantastic game. This shot here, this picture, immortalizes my first ever European Team Championship game on my first turn with my game face on. We did lose the round, but went on to play Argentina. Okay guys, we're round two, and I'm playing with Ungi from, Unguito, from Argentina. Unguito, Argentina. We're playing Drukari on Drukari. He's got all the old school stuff too, which yes. is really cool. We love Taylor. Yeah, check that out. Old school Taylors. <laughs> it's mission two. We lost round one, but we're trying. Okay, <laughs> on to the game. Okay, so I did miss all of day two, but we ended up playing Italy and playing Romania as well. We got a loss and a win. And then I decided to take a look at all the cool hobby stuff. Okay, we are here. Holy gracias. That's Unguito. Hey, how are you? Argentina. We're just gonna look at the armies. Okay. This is the um, Scottish team. You can see here the, their stuff up. That's their Eldar right there. The Stodies, Jet Lights, Dark Eldar, Ice Eldar. I'm going to take some time to look at the armies here. The Custodies, Zombies, or Blade Bearers. Like, this is relatively simple to do. But it's not a good chance for me. Yeah, sure. This is a slow play, this is your official score. We have to fuck with you in the middle of your match. Just on your last match or your fifth match, something will just fuck with you. Usually. You got team number two. Come around and show you those guys. It's really cool. This is an amazing looking army. Shadow swords and stuff. They're really neat. Dark kin. Ah, they're dark. <clears throat> so, thousand suns. More knights. It's really nice for weathering. Fantastic. Bit of a like French team. Next 
team. More in our area of playgrounds. There's, there's some like archetype lists. Then look at this. This is great. Hey Pascal. Hey, Hi, how's it going? Pascal yeah. from New Zealand. Hey Scary, how's it going? Look fabulous. If you haven't seen his knights, I'll put a picture up right here. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, the weathering on his knights is really nice. Which, uh, which army, which, uh, which, um, did you guys look for? Oh, just looking right now. We just got Oh, back, okay, so. you're just voting. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I like, I like that the French team has some, like, if only, if, only they'd, if only they'd been so lovely during the games. <laughs> Makes sense. Ooh, ooh, the burn. The burn. <laughs> okay, and then we have... Some towel. This towel looks really nice, and then some nice Drakari, like very like beaten down style, with some brighter Drakari. More knights. These are all like zombie themes. Pretty cool. These are some cool ones. And then you have the knights. This is Team Scotland. Got Blackies, Harlequins, the army I played first round. Right, Dan? Right. That's right. Dan's playing Harlequins. Drukari and then Innes's Renegade Nightlist. Oh no, Innes is that Renegade Nightlist. Hey, go, how's it you going, You've got mate? to vote for your colonial brothers. Oh Come my on. goodness. I'm, I have a Romanian guy. I'm just kidding. How's it going? Whoa. Hey! Yes. Are you live? Uh, no. Right. He's the I face of ECC. He's the face of ECC. I Based am. on his shirt. I should. I have a shirt. One of those shirts. It's amazing. Okay. Okay. So it's day three. We're here with the team, practicing early in the morning. It's about an hour before rounds start. Wearing our hockey jerseys. Super fun. So rounds are up. We're playing Poland, a very hard team. Right now we're down middle of the pack. Um, we're 15th out of 32 and we're currently two wins and two losses two more games to go and very excited about these next matchups so let's see how it goes but the team is excited fresh ready to rock and roll doing some practicing and we're gonna do our best so middle of round five playing custodies very tight game just had to get bathroom break, put water on my face. Very nice guy, but man, these, are, these games just are so good. And I just wanted to take a moment to just soak it all in. You know, it's, it's been an absolute pleasure playing for Canada so far. The team's great, really love it. And uh, you're gonna meet my opponent, he's from Poland. Great guy, I'm learning, I'm learning some Polish words and uh, we're just having an absolute blast. So, you know, they take the ETC very seriously in Poland. They're one of the favorites to win the tournament. So I just wanted to introduce you to the world. Hello. <laughs> awesome, so he's doing his movement now and we'll see you later. We're just about to start the ceremony. I'm here with the chairman. The chairman, the yeah, one, yeah, the man, the, the only. The one, the man, the only from Scotland. Who did you play first round? Of we the Canadian played team? Th th these chunks. Oh, that's right. And, and why was it painful for us? <laughs> oh, because apparently you guys don't know how to AR or what your lists do oh, my or goodness. how to play ETC format. That's terrible. <laughs> hey, hey, no, we know two <laughs> of those. But Scotland did get. The first one you're right on. He's going to get third. Third, third place. Podium. Third they place. Really hard. Yeah, and they got better then. England, most importantly. First time we played England at ETC. Very good. Fifth place, they came in, and we got third. That's awesome. Anyway, stay tuned, we'll see the ceremony as it happens. Russian. Yeah, 
questions? <laughs> This ETC was marked by chairs and breaking.
That was best overall. Bullish. We faced in round five. Okay. Awesome. Hello, my Irish friend. Next time I'm, I see you, I'm buying you the beer. There you go. I don't drink, but thank you so much. Oh, you reminded me of that before. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> enjoy yourself. Oh, I had a great time. Thank Quite you so much. It was fantastic. Okay. Sunday night after the ETC. What a fantastic experience. I could not be happier with the way that everything went. And I'll break it down, I'll kind of do a sit down when I get back to Canada and we talk about it and whatnot. But fantastic players, great venue. I could not be happier with uh, the event itself. And we're gonna get better and better. Big congratulations to the US of A who won. You guys worked really hard for it. It's a tough competition, good job. And with that, the tournament was over and back to Canada we came. I met so many great people at the ETC in 2018. I cannot wait to make that trip once again. The games were incredibly tight. They were incredibly tough. The players, the heart that was put into the event, the dedication of the teams, the hardships some of them had to go through in order to be able to make it to this worldwide stage. From Romania to Argentina to Serbia to Poland to England and Scotland to Canada, Everybody came together under the flag of Warhammer 40,000. What a fantastic event and venue. I cannot wait for 2019 that will be in Serbia. A huge shout out to all the channel Patreons and everybody who supported me on this journey. You can check the links down below if you'd like to know more. And I am Skari, your grateful host, signing off until next time. Scary out.